Hi, good morning boys and girls. It's I'm glad that you're back and you're ready for another day of learning. Today is Wednesday, March 25th. And so we have another wonderful day of learning ahead of us. Um, the second grade teachers and I have been meeting in virtual meetings and we've been discussing things that are working and not working. So I need your help. I want you to let me know what kinds of things are working well. Is posting assignments to Class Dojo easy for you were you able to download the dojo app to your device okay um, are the videos helpful for you when you watch them but I want to also know what things are difficult what has not been working are you having any problems with anything at all please let me know one parent shared with me that the links that I've sent in the class stories were not working so if that's not working for you please let me know otherwise I won't know and I won't be able to fix it but I'm gonna try to find out why that is happening um, it could be because you need to be logged into your Google account because it is a link from to my Google Drive that I shared with everyone okay so please let me know um, if you can't comment anywhere then have your parents comment to me in their messages um, your family challenge today is to take four selfies each selfie with a different expression and also um, include adjectives to describe each photo okay so I sent a um, a picture an example for you to see mine um, so please go ahead and get some ideas from that um, I used photo booth but you're welcome to use just your camera and that works too um, and have and have fun go ahead and get props and some fun things to um, make your expression even more um, more fun with different props that you have around your house okay i'm really super excited to see your post so um go ahead and upload it to your class dojo portfolio okay i can't wait um you have another assignment today which is to log into iReady and make sure your qr code is working that you have access to iReady and to go ahead today and do 30 minutes of iReady reading okay that is your assignment for today if you can't log into iReady for any reason you need to let me know because it is important that we get you up and running by the end of this week okay and then your last um your last assignment is to do your math review practice so i'm gonna show you what i need you to do okay so your assignment today is to do two pages in your grade two mathematics i ready packet that was sent home with you on friday of the week before spring break i want you to complete pages three and pages four today that's it okay and it's review so it should be something that you can do independently um but i'm gonna go ahead and show you a little video of what i'm hoping and expecting from you so that way um you are successful with it okay and it's um a little bit of a review okay so the first thing is the make 10 strategy. So I have here an example from page three, it's number six, it's the make 10 strategy. So the problem is seven plus five, you know, we know how to do that, it's fairly simple for us. But what is important is that you are able to explain the make 10 strategy when you're using this, um, when you're doing this problem. Okay, so one way to explain yourself when you're talking about how I use the make 10 strategy to solve this problem um, is to use a number line, okay? So, okay, so if I start at seven, and if I have to add five, but I don't wanna just add five, I wanna be using the strategy that is being practiced today, which is the make 10 strategy. So rather than putting seven in your head and counting up five, we're gonna break up five. And we're gonna break up five so that we can make a 10. So I know that seven plus three makes 10. So I'm gonna break up five to three and two. So that means that I'm gonna start at seven and I'm gonna do a jump of three, that will get me to 10. Okay, so it's important that I use this strategy. Okay, 
Um, and then after that, I know that I just have to add the two remaining. Okay, and so my answer is 12. Okay, so what, there is a section in your worksheet that asks for you to describe or, or explain, excuse me, explain your strategy. And that's on, that's number seven, um, that's 17, and that's for explaining problem number 11. So you need to be able to do that and explain how you broke up one of the numbers so that you could make use the make 10 strategy. So you could draw a number line down here, like how I did. Okay, to explain that strategy. Okay, and then the next one is on page four, number four, you're using doubles and doubles plus one. So that's the very next page that I'm assigning today. And I want you to also use this strategy, okay? So I, Ra, I don't want you to just put five in your head and count up six or put six in your head and count up five, okay? I want you to practice the strategy that is being asked and that is to use your doubles and doubles plus one, okay? So one way to show my thinking is that I see five and six. For me, five plus five is very easy. So instead of looking at it as five plus six, I'm gonna break up six into five and one. And then that will let me to use this particular strategy. So now I have five plus five, which is 10. And then I'm gonna add one more. And so my answer is 11. So that is how I can show that strategy, okay? Okay, okay. Which, which is the doubles and doubles plus one. All right, have fun with all your assignments today. Please um, post your work. Um, I ready is not gonna be given points to do. Um, I am gonna be checking to see that you're logging in and that you are doing your time on I ready, but points will be given for every work post that you make. So you can get a point for your your selfies and you can also get a point for your packet okay so um remember every 10 points you get you're going to get a special surprise okay and i'm really working hard on thinking about what kinds of things i can get out to you folks okay but it will be something fun um so that is all for today have a great day do your assignments post them to your dojo portfolio okay can't wait to see them bye